Welcome to Loomly. In this video, you will learn how to create and schedule your first post. You can create posts from any view in Loomly by clicking on the green New Post button at the top right of the screen. If you are on your dashboard, like here, you will need to select the calendar in which you want to create your post. If you are already inside one of your calendars, you will automatically skip this step. This launches Loomly's famous Post Builder. Post Builder assists you step-by-step -step to create better content on social media. Let's take a look. In step one, Loomly suggests to you some post ideas for inspiration based on trending topics, RSS feeds, date-related events, and social media best practices. You can then set a generic date and time for your posts, which will apply to all your channels. You can also define a subject, only for reference within Loomly, and apply labels to your post. Labels are very useful to categorize your posts inside Loomly. When creating a post, you can save it as a draft at any time with the Save Draft button. In step two, click on the social media icons corresponding to the channels you want to publish your post to. If you select Pinterest as a channel, this is where you pick your Pinterest board too. In step three, define base content and upload base media files, which will apply to all your selected channels. You can fine tune everything in the next step. Supported media types include single images, multiple images, and video. You can upload images and video, one, directly from your computer, two, from your library, three, from a URL. Loomly offers its own URL shortener, loom.ly. This is a convenient way to make long web addresses into short URLs when you create social media posts. As an added bonus, loom.ly URLs give you access to essential link metrics, including clicks, sources, and locations in advanced analytics. In step four, you can fine tune your post for each social media channel. This section is really convenient to customize each element of your post. Copy, for example, like adding hashtags to Twitter and Instagram, date, time, and media. Loomly provides you with post optimization tips, updated in real time based on the content of your post. Step five is specific to Facebook and allows you to publish more accurately with audience targeting capabilities. Loomly offers three options. One, Facebook preferred audience, where you can choose the people you would like to reach in priority in the Facebook newsfeed. Two, Facebook audience restrictions, which limits who will be able to see your posts. And three, Facebook post sponsoring, promote your ads with Facebook ads. In the final step, you can save your post as draft, submit it for approval, schedule it, or even publish it immediately. Once you have created a post, you can preview it in post view. You can also create a post directly from calendar view. Either save a date with a quick post as a placeholder or launch post builder by clicking on build post. From your library, you can create notes and post templates. Notes are very useful when you come up with an idea or find a link that you are not ready to add to your calendar yet, but you'd like to save for later. Post templates allow you to create a boilerplate post to be used and reused as many times as you want. You can create posts from notes and post templates at any time from your library. And that's it. If you have any questions or suggestions, please contact our team either through our chat or over email at contact at loomly.com. Thanks for watching this tutorial. You should be ready to create your first post with Loomly. Log into your dashboard now.